Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you how to use the library resources to access research for your IDU. Now we're going to start on the Lamoille Union Middle School page. And if you don't know how to get here, it's lums.lnsd.org, or you can search Lamoille Union Middle School or Lamoille Union High School. So this is our web page. You're going to click library. And then this is going to bring you to the high school web page because we share a page for the library. And so under library, what you're going to do is for this piece, you're going to go to research projects. And then under research projects right here, the Vermont seal, Vermont IDU, that's where I'm going. So what I've done is I've put together a list of really great Vermont resources for you to use on your project. So the first section we have here is the Vermont Historical Society. They have an amazing amount of digital resources, um, databases that they use to collect a whole bunch of different information. Everything from an online search to digital Vermont, women's history in Vermont, Vermont Black history, uh, government, especially when women lead in government in Vermont, innovation, the Civil War, um, freedom and unity. And then we also have a podcast that has a bunch of different topics. You can also click these links to see the pages for the podcast that have all of the podcasts listed on, listed on them. So this is a podcast. This is a podcast. Then we have Vermont History Explorer, which is a really cool website aimed at students that you can use to find information about Vermont history. So this has uh, becoming a state, Vermont then and now, animals in Vermont, if you're doing um, horses or catamounts or the fossil of Charlotte. There's also people in Vermont, if you're doing someone like Ethan Allen um, or the Green Mountain Boys, well, Ethan Allen, that's all tied together, um, Calvin Coolidge, Snowflake Bentley, and then you can discover Vermont. Now, I have already linked a lot of these links onto the original website. So I'm gonna show you them from there. So you've got these links that are our project topics that you could use from Vermont Explorer. We've got a lot of great videos that you can use to research. Uh, videos are a completely awesome way to research. And you can scroll through these and see if any of those um, talk about the topics that you are researching. And this is from This Place in History, which is a video series done by uh, the Vermont Historical Society and one of our local news channels. There's also a YouTube channel. Vermont Online Magazines, the Green Mountain Mountaineer Online and Historic Roots. These are lists of the topics that are covered. And then we have more videos. Um, these are all like films that have been created for the Vermont Historical Society. And then these are all virtual tours that you can take, which I think are great. So this is all the Vermont Historical Society. Most of these are live links that you can click on. And some of them are links that you click one and then go to the other ones. We have OPAC, which I will show you in another video. We have the databases. And we have local newspapers. So for the databases, I wanted to just show you really quickly. Um, you're going to click into there on any of the databases. And these can also be accessed from our library website under databases, um, which is important to know if you're ever doing any other research. Our password is hoof, H-O-O-F. And then this is biography. So if you were doing a person, you could search that person in the biography uh, database and see what you can find. Ethan Allen, we've got some quick information here. We've got some quick facts. And then we've got five biographies, an academic journal, an image, a website, magazines, and news. I tend to go for biographies for this kind of thing. So we've got the Encyclopedia of the American Revolution. We've got Dictionary of American Biography. This one tends to be pretty short, but this one's short as well. So if you're looking for some short, sweet information about your topic, these would be good resources. I'm actually gonna click on this first one. And wow, we've got a lot of information right up front. 
We've got quick facts. We've got lots of information, but it's not too much. And then what you can do at the end is you can scroll down to the bottom or click cite up here. And this is going to give you the citation for your work cited or bibliography. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna copy it, paste it into your bibliography, and then you have correctly cited your source, which is important. So that is the databases. I highly recommend checking out the databases. I've listed the ones here that I think would be helpful to you. We've got Gale databases, those passwords are hoof. And then we've got ProQuest, which has a culture grams about Vermont. And then we have Britannica and Worldbook, which are both online encyclopedias. For these three, you have a username, Lamoille, password, union. If you need any help uh, accessing the databases, please feel free to email me. Lamoille database passwords are here. We've got local newspapers. You can search in their search bars on their websites to see if they have anything about your topic. And then I went ahead and found uh, resources for our local, um, some of our local websites that I thought would be helpful. So we've got everything from Vermont Fish and Wildlife to different um, towns websites and historical societies to state parks, to coffee makers, to Circus Smirkus. So if you were looking for a specific link, it might already be there, but if it's not, you can, you can Google, it's a good idea to make sure that you find the, the right resource for you. And sometimes that's going to the source. So if you're doing Ben and Jerry's, it's a good idea to go to the Ben and Jerry's website and check out what they have. So that is our, day, our, our website page for this Vermont IDU. If you need any help navigating it or if you have any questions, please let me know. You can always email me.